Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day today so far. If you're subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. If you're not subscribed yet and you like my content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So I have not done an update on the Duggar sisters and the Duggar in-laws in a while and I'm glad to finally get a chance to fill you all in. Ever since Counting On canceled, the Duggar family, mostly just the sisters though, have been using their platforms and their creativity to make money. As I reported a few months ago, there were already networks that have reached out to the, reached out to the sisters about deals that are sitting on the table ready to be signed. However, the moment their contracts and Josh's case is done, they will be asking for the pins. But... Best believe, under the TLC contract, that has not stopped the sisters and the in-laws from partnering and sponsoring ads for various companies. Last weekend, the girls, Jessa, Kendra, which is Joe's wife, wife and Abby, John David's wife, attended a consignment called Real Alanas of Northwest Arkansas. The girls had some perks for jumping on Instagram and sharing information about the sale. And it was pretty obvious because it's very rare, rare that Kendra and Abby will even get on Instagram and do anything. But most recently, Jessa and Ginger collaborated with a new company called Pat Pat Kids, which is a kids clothing store. The brand will send the girls free items to promote on their social media pages, as well as give them an incentive. Typically, we would call Ginger and Jessa influencers. They rely on a sponsored content to make a living. Rates for these types of brand deals also vary. Typically, an influencer that has over 1 million followers get paid over $1,000 for a sponsored story and can make up to $8,000 for an actual post depending on your engagement with the audience. The more you engage with your followers, the more sponsorship offers you receive. Of course, certain brands can negotiate an offer, and some brands, the Duggars will simply decline, just depending on, you know, the type of product it is or even the background of the company. And I actually sometimes wonder, do these brands know the background of the Duggars? Maybe not. Although the average person in 20th century would probably not consider this an actual job or work, but nowadays, this is actually how most stars that may have been canceled off a show make a living. Jessa especially because she's pretty much the breadwinner in her family. Ginger, not so much. Her and Jeremy kind of do their thing um, as a, a, a group or I guess you could say as a couple. Um, they both are really involved on social media and have different platforms of way of making money. So that's what I have for the girls as of right now. They are doing their thing. They are making money and they are not worried about Josh Case. They don't think that that will have any effect on them earning a living. So with that being said, um, you can let me know in your comments below what you think about their new deals that they have. And um, with that being said, it's all I have for you today and I will talk to you guys soon.